Hello lovers, welcome back to my channel guys. <laughs> if you're new to this channel, go ahead and smash that subscribe button, click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. And today I am actually going to show you guys Vegas in full. Um, <laughs> I don't know how things play out in the universe, but somehow I needed this, this, this baby, this project. And I am totally happy with him. I am still have some little stuff that I want to do to him. And of course, he needs to be rooted. So, um, without further ado, just keep an open mind while I am sharing him with his work in progress, so to speak. Um, he, um, <clears throat> his painting is pretty much done. I... I think I'm going to leave his lips the same. Just little things I'm like, ah, oh, should I tweak? Should I not? So anyway, I'm going to get him dressed on video with you guys today. I've went through a thousand different what outfits I'm going to put him on type scenarios today. But without further ado, oh, I did not get him any socks. Um, hmm. Well, anyway, we'll just go with it. And uh, so this is Vegas. Yep, I am definitely ecstatic about this little one. Um, I, you guys know I've been on a hunt for the longest for me a willow asleep. And um, this scope is sold out and been sold out for a while. Um, I have a couple, I call them like legends in the community, old heads, whatever you want to call them. People that's been collecting forever, painting forever. There's, <laughs> I have friends in this community that actually collect almost every freaking kit that come out. And every so often they might post, you know, um, some of them paint, some of them are just collectors but they collect all of them um i also know a few people that buy and resell wholesale like they buy and 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 then i guess sell high and i don't <laughs> listen i don't want to be the one to have to catch the high end of it but of the price but i i can appreciate it when i can't find something and they have it i'd be like oh yes <laughs> So anyway, he's sculpted by Claire Teller. Um, so, um, yeah. So I finally got a hold, got through to one of them. There is still someone out here and do not message me because I will not give up my source. There is still someone and she knows who she is and she'll probably chuckle when she see this video that also still have two blanks. <laughs> I still want one if you willing to let it go and I'm you know as, as always I'm willing to pay a little bit more to get what I want but anyway so I feel like for the first time in a long time I say it every now and then but not as often I'm gonna put them on a hat before I turn them around I just think when they're bald they just look better when they have their little hats on all right I I um I feel like he is hard to photograph for me. I am still trying to learn how to pick up his coloring. Um like I believe right now he's showing a little lighter than what he is, I think. So, yeah, so then I think he's, I don't know, but anyway, he has his color, <laughs> but um, his, like his lip color is, I wanted it to be very fleshy and very translucency so that it looked like regular lips and not as much as like a baby with lipstick on or that type thing. So this is a different type of lip color that I was playing with is multiple colors. So in person you can see the different variations in his lips and it just looks very fleshy to me. So 
on camera it may come across a little pale but it's not I can assure you of that and I, I don't know if you can see that like that's his lip color um I mimic the veining of my grandson Bryson in his forehead and in his arms and stuff in places that Bryson had veins because I always struggle I don't know about people that paint other people that paint but I always struggle with where do I put the veins <laughs> I'm like where where do, where do I put the veins like the vein placement um some places is signature that I always put the veins in my babies um one thing I did not do and I, I don't know, I might have to go back and do that. I did not put the vein in his top of his foot that I normally do to almost all my babies have a vein in top of, on the top of their foot. But he, do, he does not. <laughs> he does not. Um, I stopped working on him um, out of fear of that I would go too far with him. Um, he has a lot of modeling, little bruising and stuff like that. Not bruising, bruising, but because he's a little older than just just born. But you know where it's starting to clear up and stuff. But I also just felt like I needed to have a baby to hold for whatever reason. I guess, I don't know, maybe I was subconsciously or not. It just was meant for me to have something new when everything just hit <laughs> with me. Um, let me see if I can turn him over on his back. Um, again, like I said, it's, so that's his old tummy, his old belly button. Um, that's his back. Oh, I guess you guys can't see, hold on. You want to show your back? You don't want to show your back? <laughs> That's his old back. That's his old back back. So, yeah. Like I said, it's, it, you know, it's always little things that I, I have to go and correct or, um, you know, make better or whatever. And I, this is why, like, I absolutely love working with the silicone for my personal self, <laughs> but to do it for someone else, I it makes me a little nervous because so much goes into the silicone. Um, it's so much more goes into it than the vinyl, but um, it's worth it. So anyway, let me put his little outfit on. That hat is not gonna fit on you like it should, I don't think. Oh, these don't have snaps. This little outfit, it doesn't have snaps. I don't even know what size it is. It's probably too big. Um, but I just realized, let's see, it says zero to three. It doesn't have like snaps in the, the, the seat area, which I guess is good. I can, I'll just slide it up. That way I don't have to take it over his head. But, um, but yeah. So let me see something. Let me see. He's 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 a softy. Let me see if I can show you guys his little wrinkles. Well, can I show their wrinkles? So I went back when I was I was like touching up some of his matting, right? And I went back and I went to it was a little area around his nose, right? Like right here that had a little shine on it. So I went back to do that area. And in the process of doing that area, I made a little shine right there so it looked like his nose is running which is so crazy i keep saying oh i'm gonna change that i'm gonna go in there and fix it but i haven't went in and fixed it yet. i just like i just want to play with him right now i don't care but yeah so he wrinkles really nicely say i'm a wrinkle buddy say i'm a wrinkle baby yes i am so i love doing this i had him on the bed the other day getting him dressed and i was just like doing this like not that part but doing this i like doing this to the babies that's the bottom of his feet so i am so in love with him and you guys know now if you don't know some of you guys might know about uh baby casein baby casein was like the third silicone baby i ever painted and 
I was so bummed out when I had to send that girl her baby back. <laughs> like, I really was like, not really, like, I knew I was gonna send it back, but in my head I was like, gosh, I'm gonna be on the scammer page. I need to keep this one. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just, I just loved him so much. And it was, I think it was something that always like, bugged me that I never got the blank. Um, I think when I did, I, I, I wasn't going to get it. And then when I tried to get one, I didn't get it. Um, someone else beat me to it. I, I ain't going to say who it was, but it's probably this one person that bought like 20 of them, but she knows who she is too. <laughs> um, but so I always was kind of bummed out because I wanted me, I know y'all it be in y'all feelings, but I wanted me a light skin, um, willow asleep. So I've been working for months, a year, trying to get different people I know that had not painted theirs to, <laughs> To give in <laughs> um anyway that's that so he is a sweet baby and he has been a lot of comfort during this time because sometimes I just pick him up and just hold him a little bit and I absolutely do not like that <laughs> on him so he will not be wearing that <sighs> that was a waste all right so I don't know if y'all want to stay for this but he's he's coming out of that I'll be honest with you it just don't work let me see if I can grab something really quick for him um I did have sleeper ideas for him, but I put them back and he looked absolutely too light. It is so crazy. Okay, hold on. I know, y'all just bear with me. I'm gonna go get that other sleeper that I was thinking about to begin with. And nope, I'm not editing it out, that space, so you can skip forward that part. Oh, these look so big though. They said three months, but this, this is huge. Let me see. I wanna put him in some color. Oh, I don't know, no, no. All right, we are gonna try it. This might be too big. It looks like it's gonna be too big, but we are gonna try it anyway. All right, we're gonna try this again, Mr. Bossman. Mr. Bossman, Mr. Bossman. I have two different hats over here too. I have a blue one and I have this one, which is super busy. But Paper City Dolls sent that to me because I asked for it when I bought a baby from her. I really wanted that hat. So I kept that hat. Oh, you what a what a what a what a baby. Yeah, so so his vein and in his stomach and in his arm are oh I just love him in just a diaper. Don't you guys just love him in just a diaper? Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh I actually you do? You want to get your your feet up? You push it, push your little feet up. There you go. <laughs> You're like, uh, nope, I don't. <laughs> okay, anyway, let's, let's try this. All right, so between these people now with the, now they do the cloth. So I'm popping this off if he don't wear it and you see it in your box opening, that means it's still brand new because he didn't fit it. And I put it back on the hanger. So 
I usually try not to pop the tags off until I know they're gonna actually wear them because I use some clothes for my personal babies and some clothes for box openings. So, Mr. Mr. And I rooted his eyebrows, so <laughs> they get a little messy sometimes. Wait, what is that? I am going to redo his, um, uh-oh. I'm going to redo his eyelashes. They are hideous. The worst ever. <laughs> oh, gosh. I love my little life. All right, so let's see what we can do. Y'all know when y'all dressing these babies to grab these things through the sleeve and not pull on your actual baby. Yep, mama's rough today, mama's rough. He's like, mama, I hate when you dress me on camera. I know, cause mama's so rough on camera. It's like, you know, I think that's when people mess up their toss the most, probably. When they're doing videos and taking pictures for the camera and for social media. They probably get, you, you get so excited and you're trying to, you know, be in the right angle and making sure everything looks good and stuff. And I think that's when it's like, oh gosh, I just did so and so. I think that's when people mess up. All right, Poco. I'm gonna put this hat on because I'm sick of seeing you with the ball head. There we go. I can't root him until I finish everything and ensure 100, 1,000% that his, um, I'm done with his painting, I'm done with his matting. I don't wanna, I don't wanna root him until after that, just, just in case. Just in case, just in case. Cause the way I want to root him, his hair is gonna probably come down in his face a little bit. So if I change anything with his painting, I'll have to, that hair would be in the way. Oh, I think it's working guys. I think you can fit it. <laughs> yep. And then after he wear it, Bryson will get to fit it at some point. Rice and still put a little peanut. So, but I like it. It don't match your blanket now, do it. But that's okay. Because guess what? Real babies don't always match their blankets. And you're a real boy. <laughs> you're a real boy. I feel better. When I first started the video, I almost like, oh, I can't even talk. It's like everything hurts to do everything, you know. So, and then I started doing my video and I feel a lot better. Look at you. All right. So, we got them all covered up there. I used to think when people have their babies all covered up, I'm like, what is they hiding? Baby must be have ugly hands or something. But now, I do it because I just think it's cute. And now I realize that some people may be just doing it for the same reason. They just like to see them covered up. Oh my goodness. Isn't he adorable? <gasps> I love you. Where is your passy? You should have a passy. Ooh, mama need to find your passy. Oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh. whoa. Mm -hmm. Oh, do we got some KY? Yes, we do. KY, KY, coming up. KY. It's good to use that KY. But if I was planning on painting him some more, I don't think on his mouth, I don't think it would have been a good idea. But guess what? I don't care because I don't think I'm going to change his mouth. I have this pacifier, but it looks like it's yellowing for some reason so we gonna give him this one 
Well, I thought I was going to give it to him. Do you even want it? Dude. Mm, not really a passy baby. Not that one anyway. Mama, that's too dainty. Okay. Sorry, Puka. <laughs> Sorry, Puka. Alright. Anyway. So that's that. Alright, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with us today. We'll see you later. If you want to see more of his photos, check him out. And some full body shot videos I did record for Instagram. So if you guys follow me on Instagram, it's Miss Serenity underscore Smith. You guys will catch more of Vegas. Bye-bye now.